Hey guys, Pete with you here. Welcome back to the channel. How are you all doing? Are you doing okay? Feeling good? Taking care of each other? Well, I sure hope so. Well, you know what? Today is the second day of spring and it is a beautiful day. Oh my goodness. It is, and look, I'm not even wearing my hoodie. It's, it's that comfortable outside right now. And I am up in Lancaster County today. I'm gonna show you guys another covered bridge. This one is still active, and this one is longer than Gilpin's Falls that I went to a few weeks ago. So we're gonna check it out together. Are you ready? Let's do it. All right, so here it is. This is the Pine Grove covered bridge right here. Check that out. It is 195 feet long and 15 feet wide and it's still active so it's only a one lane bridge so you kind of have to honk your horn when you go through and here comes a, a truck right now coming through on this end and you can see there are people sitting on the ledge right there how cool is that so here comes that uh, truck Moving nice and slow, as he should be. Pretty cool. We're gonna go check out some more. So I'm walking down to the side of it here, just to let you know some history. This bridge was built in 1884 by Elias McMillan. And as I said, it's 195 feet long and 15 feet wide and it goes over the Octorero Creek which heads down that way and if it sounds familiar this creek is the same one that I saw when I did my birthday vlog in Port Deposit when I visited that old abandoned train bridge and it's the same creek that went underneath that bridge and it flows into the Susquehanna. But check that out. Look, there's like a little waterfall over there too. Very nice. So I walk down to get it closer and you can see there's people over there hanging out. As I look at the, they just heard a car go through it. There's the bridge up right under it. And I've been seeing a lot of Amish today too. They're out for their Sunday drives, if you will, in their horse and buggies. There's an old building there. Not quite sure what that is. This is amazing. Very pretty. Now, if you saw the vlog that I did on Gilpin's Paul's covered bridge, you may remember that it had a lot of openings in the side, like little windows. This one just has one. And it's right there. And again, there's some people just enjoying the day, the view. Getting a little zen. And I'm getting that too. So here we have another view from the side. I'm gonna walk down this way check out the creek which is absolutely beautiful and when I pulled up there were yeah five or six people out here fishing and I believe there's bass in here I'm not sure what else and I, there's some people right down there I don't know if they're fishing or not
But look at that. That's very nice. Tranquility. Just pull up a chair or sit on the grass and enjoy it. Or sit on the wall like they are. What a view they have. Again, what a picture-perfect day. It's a great day to be out. I was out yesterday, too. I was up in Conowingo yesterday. And maybe you guys already saw that vlog. That was a lot of fun. And this is a lot of fun, too. Never been here before. Only heard about it. And it was on my vlog list. Wanted to come check it out. I'm also reflecting a little bit today because 18 years ago today, I lost my dad, cancer. So, God bless you, dad. I think about you every day. And if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be doing things like this because he was the one that took me out all the time. Let's go for a drive. You know, he took the whole family out. We went out on Sunday drives and saw different things. So, I get that from him. So, here's another look at the creek. It flows under the bridge. And again, this is the Ocarero Creek. And it goes all the way down to Port Deposit and then into the Susquehanna. Just beautiful. And you could tell, and that bridge, again, it's 195 feet long. Look how, how big it is. Now, there are some openings in the top, as you can see, but the other one, Gilpin Falls had windows on the side, just like that one there. Now, as you can see, this bridge is painted red. And red is the traditional color of Lancaster County. So that's why it is red. Now, it's just red on the outside. They didn't paint it red on the inside. And there goes the car. So I think what I'm gonna do is get in my car and go through it and I'll film it so you guys can see and I'm gonna get out on the other side and walk around. All right guys, here we go. I'm gonna go through it. I'll go through it slow so you can take a good look at it. How cool is that? There's another car waiting for me to come through so it can pass there we go I think I'm gonna park over here somewhere so after taking a look closer look there goes some Amish right there that is the Ocarero water company Founded in 1904. Now I'm going to walk down here just to get a closer look at this side and the dam. As you can see, no boating, no swimming, no wading. Check that out. Very nice. How beautiful is that? Now here's a view from this side 
of the bridge. You guys can probably hear it's very loud, but pleasantly loud. And you can see the span is 10 feet, seven inches. Anything taller will not work out. Now, unlike Gilpin Falls covered bridge, that was no longer in use or active that I was able to walk through. This one I'm not able to walk through because it is, well, like I said, it's 195 feet long and it is active. And uh, I just want to be careful. And there, are, it is kind of busy. So, no walking through, I'm sorry. But you're getting a good look at it from all angles. I hope you're enjoying it. I will show you this. Here's the view I'm standing directly in front of it. And you can see right through to the other side. Another very cool and interesting bridge that I got to see. And you guys got to see too. All right, guys, we're about to go back through it again. And here we go. Look at that. That is very cool. Very cool. So I'm back on the other side where I started. And if you watch the opening there, you're going to see a Amish buggy come through in just a few seconds. They are out and about today and uh, very friendly. They were waving to me. I thought that was uh, very cool. Maybe we'll get a wave out of this this group here. And here comes another car behind it. Yeah. There they are. That was just a single driver there. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate you watching, and I hope that you enjoyed coming up here to the Pine Grove Covered Bridge in Lancaster County. What a thrill it was to see this, and not to mention the Acarero Creek that runs below it. And just to let you know, this is Asheville Road that it runs on. So if you wanna come up here and check it out, just Google Pine Grove Covered Bridge and it'll come right up and it'll show you how to get here. Thank you so much for watching once again. I really, really, really appreciate you guys. I appreciate you all. Thank you so much. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you really like this video, give it a thumbs up for me. I really appreciate it. More to come. Stay tuned. Thank you so much once again. Remember to take care of each other. Stay safe. When you're able to, share a smile. It's contagious. This is Pete. I'll see you on the next one. Until then, peace.